First, we go to breaking news of a stabbing on board a metro train near the Federal Center metro stop, and it's causing rush hour delays. Diane Cho is live outside the metro station. Uh, Diane, you told us earlier that the victim appears to be a good Samaritan. Is that right? That's right, Allison. Uh, we're told that the victim was actually trying to help someone else during an attempted robbery when he was stabbed in the hand. And this is where it all ended here outside the Federal Center uh, Metro stop. And I want to show you what's going on here behind me. You can still see that there are several officers remaining here on the scene, but everything else has pretty much resumed back to normal. We have video of the alleged suspect as he was being taken into custody with blood on his hands here outside the Metro stop. But at this point, we have not confirmed with authorities that that was the suspect involved. Police say they were waiting for one of the victims to return to the area to make a positive identification on him. Metro spokesperson tells us this all started around 3.30 this afternoon after the suspect got on the train at the Lawn Plaza stop heading towards New Carrollton earlier. And at some point, they say the suspect tried to rob someone on the train when another man tried to intervene to help. And that's when they say the suspect stabbed that man in the hand. Again, we're told that he is expected to be okay. Now, some of the trains were told were delayed earlier because authorities were busy trying Trying to collect evidence on the trains. We're told that took about 20 to 30 minutes, but we're told that everything should be resumed back to normal at this point. But there might be some residu residual delays because of that investigation. Back to you in the studio. Thank you, Diane.